So the people want to know, do you have a boyfriend? Sorry, do I have a what? A boyfriend. Do you have a boyfriend? A what? Do you have a boyfriend? Oh, a boyfriend. Well, okay, well, I do have someone. Um, someone I've been going out with for a while. You mind telling us his name? Oh, his name is Jesus. <laughs> You're funny, aren't you? <laughs> Get, out. Get out. Bye. Get out. You're not funny. Yeah, yeah, go. Yeah. Uh, I am for the song. She's late. You're late. Hi, I'm so sorry that I'm okay, late. Okay, let's just get started then. Um, what's your full name? My full name is Ayumide Sanjo Adifunsho. What does your name mean? Um, Ayumide means my joy has come. Sanjo, I think it means protect or something like that. Adifunsho means or there means hunter. Funsho means given to watch. I'm guessing it means the hunter that watches over. Makes sense because I've been hunting down my haters. I've been hunting down, you know, all the witches and wizards in my village. You get me? Yeah. Uh, date of birth. Uh, my date of birth, I was born on the 24th of February 1996. So I'm a Pisces, baby. What's good? Um, where are you from, Ayo? I'm from Lagos, Nigeria. And where were you born? I was born in Lagos, Nigeria, <laughs> but I've been living in the UK for a very long time, like half of my life, basically, more than half of my life. What would you say are your best characteristics? My best characteristics would be that I am I myself a very nice person, very friendly. I'm a very honest person. What you see is what you get. I'm a very supportive person. And I would say I love big, I love hard. Make love, not war. <laughs> what are your biggest fears? My biggest fears would be the dark. I don't like sleeping in the dark. At my big, big age, guys, best believe that I sleep with the lights on. I don't sleep in the dark. What inspired you to start a YouTube channel? What inspired me to shoot a YouTube video? At first, I didn't actually want to do it make a YouTube account because you know I've always been this kind of person like I like being my own person I've always loved standing out doing my own thing like I've never been one to follow the crowd so when I saw that everyone was doing this YouTube thing I was like yeah that's not me but you know I feel like I'm a very artsy creative person so I want to be able to showcase my craft and showcase who I am and I like to talk as well so that also inspired me I also want to you know this is a platform to be this YouTube I'm using YouTube as a platform to where I really want to go in life I want to be as big as Oprah fan. I want to be have my own talk show be a billionaire you know what you so yeah this is a plan a stepping stone for me to get there what's the strangest thing you believed as a child the strangest thing that I believed when I was a child was people on TV could see you. So I think that Beyonce could see me through her, through her TV. I remember this was early 2000 to 2003 when Crazy in Love came out. So I remember it would go, Doo, you ready? When I song would just, when I would just hear that, I would run. I would run into the room. I remember there was this checkered crop top that my mom bought me and this boot cut boot cut jeans that I loved then back in the days. That top and that jeans were my favourite outfits were. So I would run into my room, wear them and come outside and I would just start doing ho 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 because I really thought Beyonce could see me and I really wanted to impress her. So I would just, you know, or like I would put my energy because I really wanted to impress her so that she can, you know, hit me up so you can. What's your favourite colour? My favourite colour is pink but you know, I said I'm not a girly girl. I like pink because it's a bright colour, it stands out. And I, and I like, I like colour, I like, you know, because I feel like I'm a very bright person as well. Most embarrassing moment. Most embarrassing moment, I don't have, I don't get embarrassed. <laughs> I have no shame. Although the most embarrassing thing, maybe, wasn't really embarrassing, Jack, because I shrugged it off, bro. But when I was in Babcock, in BBS, outside BBS, they're like, if for those who, you know, know, there are two like steep stairway things, 
like you just they're like this maybe they're for like um wheelchair people there are two of them here i remember i was walking um uh, on myself i was walking down down the the, the stair thing and i just slid down and people were just looking at me like this and they were getting ready to laugh but you know what i did i just stood up and i laughed i laughed at myself shrugged and then and i kept on walking you can't embarrass someone that does not care there's power in laughing at yourself because they, they won't try and embarrass me so me too i laugh your ideal first date my ideal first and like i'm lucky at all my so don't take me to any stupid dinner i don't want to i have food in my house i'm fine like my ideal first day would be arcade gaming um bowling paintballing like go kart and something that i can really like jump and you know be active that's the kind of person I'm, i am i'm a very active and energetic person so you know I do you speak any other language i don't speak another language the only language that i speak i speak realness honey <laughs> i speak no i'm like um i speak english that is that on that What's the worst pickup line you've ever heard or dished out? Are you an accident? Cause I can't get my ass off of you. <laughs> Ew. Can you dance? Can I dance? <laughs> That's a question. Can I dance? Wait, let me. Oh, are you dumb? Hey. Yeah, how is that for can I dance? How is that? If you got stuck on the elevator and you were forced to listen to one song, what would it be? What song would I play? It would be Be the Nigger. That was uh, Beyonce and Jay Z on the run. What is the most funny or most disappointing or saddest text you've ever received? The most disappointing text that I have ever gotten was probably when my ex-boyfriend broke up with me. I thought my life was over, guys. Like, my heart was just doing this, like, I thought I was gonna die. Man, I was bawling, I'll never forget. What would people say about you at your funeral? People would say she was a real G. She kept her honey. She was... <laughs> <laughs> she was a G, my nigga. She was like, yo, yo, she was G'd up, my nigga. Like, she was a one in a billion. That's what they can't say when I die. But the thing is, I'm not gonna die. I'm not gonna die. I'm not gonna die. When y'all are dead, I'm still gonna be here. I'm immortal, bitch. If you were a label, what would it say? Tss, danger. Too hot. What personality trait do you have that gets you in trouble? Mm, I am, well, a personality trait that used to get me in trouble, Sha. Back in the days, you not know, now, I would say, when I'm still a very outspoken person, but when I was younger, I was very, very outspoken. Like, I had no filter. Whatever I thought up here, it was coming out. And that got me to a lot of trouble in Babcock when I was in Nigeria, because I guess kids in Nigeria are, are not as wild as kids in the Western world. So I went to Nigeria with this Western you know personality this western yeah yeah and that got that that shit got me into a lot of trouble a lot if you had a time machine right what time period would you go back to and why if i could if i could go back in time i would probably go back to the 90s or go and meet notorious big and steal all of Nicki minaj bars now and rap them to him so i'd be like yo to talk shit for what is you saying got the oldest dude in the game speaking my name i'm the one and he'd be like oh she got bars i'm like yeah, yeah. i got bars nigga and just like that i would go down in history as the queen of rap that's that's just it so the people want to know do you have a boyfriend sorry do i have a what a boyfriend do you have a boyfriend a what do you have a boyfriend Oh, a boyfriend. Well, okay, well, I do have someone. Um, someone I've been going out with for a while. You mind telling us his name? Oh, his name is Jesus. <laughs> You're funny, aren't you? <laughs> Get, out. Get out. Bye. Get out. You're not funny. Yeah, yeah, go. Yeah. 
Tell me, tell me, my nigga, what's it come? G-Wagon, all depends. 